Okay, so we're back over here. We want to try to enter. We're close today, so scram now. Well then, I know what I gotta do. Do, 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 do. do, do. Wait, how does it? How does the Pink Panther thing go? Um. Oh yeah, right. Do, 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 do. And then I'm the crawl like a little baby. <laughs> I love this pirate music, man. Oh, nice. Nice. Look, don't be mad at us. It's not a. Oh wait, we, I don't know which one's talking. We, yeah, not our fault that we absolutely gotta have bombs to get the treasure we're after. How about you just think of it as payback for the nasty little monopoly you've been running here, yeah? <laughs> so I bet you're thinking it was foolhardy to ask pirates to pay such an outrageous price, huh? Yep, I bet you are. You know, Gen Gonzo, I still can't get over that bit of fast talking you pulled to get that information out of the postman. Oh? Oh yeah, that was smooth. Oh wait, <laughs> I'm talking for the wrong people. Fuck, wrong voices for wrong people. I tell you, the minute I set my eyes on that Miles, I just knew he was hiding something. Back it out said, yeah. So when I saw that postman, I just pretended like I was all worried about the kid and stuff. And presto, he spills the beans. Good work, Gonzo, really. Just top notch. It's funny, though. I'm thinking this may be the first time you've shown such wit, such cunning. You know, with your cunning and Miss Tetra smarts, if you two got married and had a kid, that kid would be the greatest pirate to ever set, set sail to the seas. Yep, the greatest. Oh, wait! I am talking for the wrong people. Oh, my God. I was talking for the, the one with glasses, and, uh... I was supposed to be talking for the. I was doing the voice of the bigger guy, and I thought the bigger guy was talking. Shit. Keep your child's jokes to yourselves and get those bombs back to the ship. The second you're done loading them up, we're setting sail for Outset Island. What? Miss, we have to leave immediately? But it's been so long since we were on shore. We need to fill our bellies with some good eating, yeah? How about we get grub tonight and shove and shove off tomorrow morning instead. I mean, uh, I'll find either way, of course, whatever you say is fine, miss, is what I mean to say. It's just that the boys are so excited to come to town, yeah, and I can't help but think it would be awful hard on them to leave so soon without a proper layover. So what do you, so what say we set sail tomorrow, yeah? What do you say, miss? That treasure ain't going anywhere. You're with me, right, boys? Who's for fun? Who's for a night of fun? Yeah. Dot, dot, dot. Oh. You're all fools. Do you know that? You saw the demolished island. You saw the senseless destruction. We have to hurry to outset. Or the same thing could happen there. Jeez. You guys are idiots. Huh? Not to be disrespectful, but the sound of things, you're worried about that island and the treasure, miss. Oh. Don't be ridiculous. I want you to know the treasure. <laughs> She's like, yep, I know. Alright, fine, have it your way. We could stay and leave town tomorrow, you big babies. We we're setting sail at first light, so no sleeping in. Understood? Aye, aye! Nice. Say there, brother. What was today's password again? Uh, Baco, are you serious? You forgot already? You're so useless. Today's password is Chubbly, yeah, remember? You know that Nico won't let you in if you don't say it exactly right, and he's real picky about it. So I'll say it once more. Today's password is Chubbly, yeah. Okay, thanks. <laughs> Chubbly, eh? <laughs> Just a guy in the back are like, oh, the whole time. Whole flipping time. Oh my goodness. Well then, uh. I, I, as you can tell, I said fudge it, by the way. I'm not gonna end off the episode. Wow. 
technically it's a different episode. But you know what I mean. So, yeah, hello and welcome. It's a different episode. So I don't really totally have to say hello and welcome. But I do at the same time. But at the same time, I'm recording this all together. So I don't. You know, like I do with Dungeons. I prefer not to, but... So much pausing in this game. Kind of impossible not to. Alright, so now what we want to do anyways is head off to the ship. How do you treat a shark? Oh, yeah, this. Uh... Oh, like right. Okay, sorry about that. So yes, this episode... We will be... I think it's the same password every time, too. Um... Right, right, you may enter. Um, yeah, so this part we will be reading off the thing of Waddles. That's what I was going to say. I like Miss Tetra's bedroom. I can enter it. Baby, that feels so right. Oh, wait, she has a poster of... Is that me? The, the Triforce? Fuck. Yo, she wants me. I should just lay down on the bed here. Here, look, look, look. I'm gonna lay down on the bed here. Wait for her. My butt out. Just, just, she could come up from behind and do what she wants to me. Mm. I'm ready, Tetra. Give it to me straight. Give it to me hard. Give it to me hard, girl. I want it hard. I'm so upset you're not here yet. Give it to me hard. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I had enough of that. Oh, fuck. That voice cracked up. Um, is there anything? No, there's not. Okay. Come on. What's up? Oh, Miles, my own swabby. So you're alive. All the other pirates said you get done in by that bird monster for sacred fortress. So I thought, Nimona, I thought you're alive. Oh, I get it now. You came back because you missed me so much. Uh, I had no idea you wanted to be my... <laughs> I thought that said asshole. My swabby so badly. I see, I see. Well, after you left, I went back to being the bottom rung on the ladder, which is why I'm stuck here while everyone else is in town having fun eating and stuff. But I guess I'm so worshipped by my swabby. Ought to cheer me up. Alright, why don't we set you to your next test, huh? This one is harder than the last. Good luck. You'll need it, swabby. So, uh, yeah. Uh, platforms are gonna rise. You gotta use the lantern. The time's gonna be shorter as well. Um... But uh, you gotta use those swinging lanterns to get over. Um, it, it, yeah, it, time's shorter, and it's a little more difficult. It's it's not too hard. Um, it's still fairly easy. But I usually mess up like the first time because it's usually been a while, and then I I'm okay after that. Usually, 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 usually. Um, did I? Oh, wow. Okay, you just want to swing. Right, you don't want to swing anywhere. You just want to swing to each other, I think. Oh, wait, and they fucking move. God damn it. Fucking move. Stop moving. Yeah, thank you. That, that's weird. There we go. Um, how do we slide down a bit? Because I need... No, I don't want to go up. Too... Because <laughs> you need to slide down a bit or else you don't fly as far. And... Yep, I figured as much. <laughs> yep. So yeah, as you can tell, it is fairly easy. It's just you have to drop down um, sometimes. So like here, drop down and then start swinging again. Because y yeah, it's a pain in the ass. This thing keeps moving. God damn it! Why do they have to move? Uh, yeah, I just recommend drop it down every single time. Honestly, truthfully. And then wait for this one to move. I'm going to drop down too. Start swinging it this way. Is, is, this, is this 
gonna move yet? No? Okay. Okay, and then there's this one, and then we just do the last one. Hope we don't miss it this time. I shouldn't miss it. I shouldn't miss it. I should get it right. No! Swing down a bit. Don't want to go too far down. And then... Three, two, one, lift off! Fuck yeah! <laughs> I could have swung more and more time. That was kind of ballsy and risky, but... You gotta be. You did it already. You're incredible. It's good I've never passed this test. And you do it so quickly. How'd you fucking get here if you never passed it? I don't understand. Oh, maybe you didn't have a timer? Maybe you untimed yourself? I see. Okay, anyways. <laughs> Let's open this baby up. And now, we get... Le bombs. And now we can actually use bombs. And we can also use bombs on our ship, which is a big deal. So, yeah. Oh, what the heck? I suppose that I should be shocked, but I'm more amazed that you managed to survive after being tossed out of the wa out of the tower. I <laughs> sounds said water. From the look on your face, I have to guess you haven't saved your sister yet, huh? You don't give things much thought, do you? You just rush in, never thinking how badly things could go for you. Like just now, the only reason you got what you did was because we left a simplified little rat like Nico behind to look after things. No one else would have parted with our treasure so easily, I assure you. Hi, cat. She just like pushed the fucking door open. <laughs> and just how you intend to use those bombs anyway. Don't tell me you're going after Jaboon's treasure too. Right now, Jaboon is hiding in a cave at the back of the island you were born on. But the entrance is blocked by a giant stone doorway. You can't get in without breaking down the door. We're going to relax in town and eat our fill of whatever in his eh, whatever town has to offer. But we'll be leaving for outset first thing in the morning. If you manage to find Jibun tonight, then I guess you win. But if you take too long, we'll come saying right by you tomorrow morning. And believe me, you didn't get all of our bombs. You would better be quick, kid. Well, I better get going. Later, bro. See you later. I'll probably never see you again. Never see you again. Alright, guys. We're back out here. Where's our boat? It should be over here. Where'd you go? Boat? The fuck? Oh, my God. He's at the docks. I have to go get a mail anyways. The bitch is at the docks. Isn't he? The bitch is at the docks. Why'd you go there? You knew I was at the pirate. Fuck. Anyways. Uh, go and get the letter here and you're gonna get beetles chart um so after getting the bombs you'll get beetles chart and now i think you can i think it said you can also buy bombs there too which is pretty good uh i actually kind of want to stop at beetles really quick before we head to outset it's gonna be a hell of a journey honestly um but uh yes yeah, so you get beetles chart and now you can see where beetle is it all the different locations which is awesome uh no he has nothing so let's just head to outset well done our preparations are complete what the girl says is true the pirates won't be leaving until morning we must be with jaboon and get the pearl from him before they arrive let us delay no longer bombs. all right let's go fuck <laughs> Oh shit! Foolish creature who does not fear the gods. To the end of the sea with you. Let the winds of Cyclosis' wrath blow you away. Oh shit, I forgot about this. Alright, time to fuck him up. We have the cannon. And I don't think we can fuck him up until we get the bow and arrow. No, we can't. Ah, crap!
Oh god, took us long enough. Whew. Have you noticed, Marles? Morning has not broken since we arrived at Great Fish Isle. The land that was so ravaged by monsters. It is as if time itself is frozen. Perhaps this is the curse that Valu spoke of. Whatever the reason, if this night does not end, then we need not worry about the pirates overtaking us. In fact, it might not be a bad idea for you to visit your hometown and family again after such a long time away. We can speak with the Jaboon after you do. We have a couple things. Who do? One of them is following me. The Great Fairy. Because, yeah. Because, yeah. 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 And we also uh, are going to get a uh, sword thing. Power up thing. Yeah, that. You know what I mean. You know what I'm talking about. Anywho. Oh god, there's fucking... Right, I forgot this monster's here. There's monsters everywhere because of this curse. Like, did you see all the things I passed? Man. Gosh, it's turned into Phantom Hourglass. I mean... Phantom Hourglass is basically this. But with less lands. Land. Basically, what Phantom Agnes is, I think. Oh, fuck! These guys are here! That's right! Anyways, yeah, we wanna come up here for the Great Fairy. Gotta, we gotta kill these old guys, so. Get rid of them, because they're annoying! Fuck these things, man. I'm probably just gonna roll past the rest of them. But... Or there's no more. Watch, I spoke too soon. No, I didn't. Wait, what's this? I know this guy. Um, do, do we want to go here? Is this where we had to go? No, it's not. Alright. Uh, I think we want to get across, maybe? I don't know. I don't remember! Okay, so you want to make the wind blow west. That's all you want to do. And then we want to want to come up here. Come up here. I'm on the, this big rock right here. First, I'm going to get some more magic because I fucked up, didn't climb on the rock, and wasted some magic. Hello? Magic! Magic power? Hello? Are you there? Oh, fuck you. Oh, these these give out stuff too, but it looks like it- Oh! Oh! Got the magic I wanted. Got the magic I needed. Baby, oh baby. Magic power. Anyways. <laughs> Jump. And then, we just kind of go this way. Over to this. <gasps> no! Are you kidding me? That didn't just happen. That did not just happen. That did not just fucking happen. Fuck. There we go. Fuck. That was harder than it should have been. Anyways, uh, yeah, we're gonna want to come in here. There are different enemies here now, of course, because we're not at the start of the game. But, you know, um, that. Oh! Oh, hi, you! I remember you. You're great. Fucking annoying, actually. What? What was that exchange? Please explain what the heck that just... What? Okay, whatever. <laughs> um, I think we have to go this way. Just like we did last... Yep, right here. I'm gonna come up here. If we can. Uh, anyways. Come up here. Drop this. Ah, uh, boom. There we go. And we're gonna drop down here. We're gonna get ourselves. Are you ready? Are you excited about this upgrade? I am so excited about this upgrade. I'm very excited about this upgrade. Very exciting. It's the big wall. It's the big it's the wallet upgrade. I, I think it's just called Big Wallet. I think. I don't know. We'll find out in a second. Young Wave of the Winds, allow me to aid you in your quest. As she blows her petals towards me, I wonder why you're blowing your petals at me. You know what? I just noticed she's a bit of a different color than the other one. Like I don't usually visit these one, these fairies. But yeah, um, they carry up to a thousand rupees. It's crazy. It's crazy. But this game needs it. Because, yeah. 
Anyways, we could get a bunch of fairies. So if you don't have any fairies, grab them. I already have one. Also, Grandma needs one. Grandma, no! Hey! 